you feel like you guys as the first team? I feel like we had an average day. I mean, we got to get out there. We got to get better every single day. And I mean, we don't, we're not nowhere right now where we want to be. I mean, we want to be a dominant defense this year. I mean, we're going to try to do that. And I mean, this fall cameras is going to help us build us to that point. So that's what we got to do. I think guys called y'all pretty dominant today, but you say average. What, what do you feel like y'all need to do better? Uh, everything. We got it's, it's so much more that we can do, man. Like, I mean, we want to put, we want to, we want to be able to stop teams and just be dominant, like I said. So I mean, that comes from you got to give up. If you want to be number one defense, man, you got to do so much to get there. And I mean, just like Coach Steele says, we're putting in the work now. It's just like putting money in the bank. You can't go cash out unless you put the work in and put the money in now. Any of the younger guys on defense stand out to you? Uh, I mean, yeah, I think they all progressively getting better. I mean, just like I said, like this is brand new. I mean, throwing the throwing the heat into it a little bit. You got all the coaches out there. This new playbook. So I mean, they all getting better day by day. They just got to learn them, learn stuff. Did you guys give up any scores on your defense? Uh, yeah, I believe we gave up one. One TD. Yeah. What, who, who scored it or what happened on the play? Uh, I don't even know. It's just. I don't. I can't even remember the play for real. <laughs> Nick was saying Javar's had a pick six. Do you remember about the other interception fail? Mm. <laughs> I really don't. Nick, force of turnovers. Though. That's that's been an emphasis for a few mm. years. How how important is that to come out on day one of a scrimmage and go out there and, and produce like that? Um, I mean, that's definitely good. I mean, I think being able to get turnovers, man. It's Coach Steele's been stressing. I mean, he wants. He wants that to be a big emphasis on this year. So, I mean, that's the thing that the guys are going for. And, you know, all of us are up there trying to, trying to make that happen. So, I mean, you know, our coaches, I mean, we feel like that they put us in the best position and do what we do best. So, I mean, we just listen to them and we try to, you know, whenever they make some of the emphasis, then we got to go do it. What have you seen out of Treesdale besides you? I know he's been getting a lot of work uh, in, in camp so far. Uh, I mean, he's training. I mean, it's a whole new truth. She's proud of him. Really? What, what's, the, what's been the biggest thing, what's been the biggest difference for you that you've seen out of him? Oh, he's training. I'm not getting tired. I mean, he's pushing through a lot of things, and I mean, he's stepping up, elevating his game a lot right now. How big is that for you guys? You, know, you said he's straight, he's not getting tired. Just to be able to get a few more snaps out of him, how big would that be for this line? Uh, I mean, you know, uh, it's a big because I mean, we gotta get we gotta get our guys back healthy, and you know, get everybody back in. What type of playmakers, JD, for you guys on defense? Javaris and Jeremiah. Javaris. Uh, Man, they, the boys back there, they want that ball. So, I mean, they're going to do everything they can. And then, you know, when we make things bounce to the outside, they're going to fly down and knock stuff down. So, I mean, ain't no fear back there. So, I mean, that's Javaris, uh, Jeremiah, uh, Daniel, all them boys back there. I mean, they're they ready for it. So, that's just what they do. And they got to swag about it. So, this is what they do. We heard Marlon the other day talk about Jared 